Last weekend fans of the ITV reality show watched as England lioness Jill Scott walked away the winner of this year's series. With Owen Warner and Matt Hancock following closely behind in second and third place, Mike Tindall narrowly missed out on reaching the final. Although when he left the Australian jungle, he had some apologizing to do to his wife Zara. After three weeks in the Australian jungle, MA celeb fans finally got to see which person would be this year's winner. It seemed Gil Scott got along with all of the other stars in the show, yet with many revealing to Ant and Deck they'd want her to win during their exit interview, one friendship outshone all the rest. Mike Tyndall and soap star Sue Cleaver quickly became close friends in the show with the former rugby star often referring to her as his camp wife. However, when he left the series coming in fourth place, it was time for him to finally be reunited with his actual wife, Zara Tyndall. Will we get a bank holiday for King Charles' coronation? Buckingham Palace has officially confirmed when King Charles III will receive his coronation. But what does that mean for Britons? Will we get a bank holiday for King Charles' coronation? Before he officially left the camp, Zara commented that the kids have missed him and that it'll be nice to have him out. Once his chat with Ed and Deck was finished, the former rugby star walked across the bridge to be reunited with Zara after three weeks apart from one another. Despite the duo embracing each other in a hug, Mike wasted no time in apologizing to her on the car journey back to their hotel. Speaking to Zara, he said, I'm sorry I had a camp wife in there, but she was brilliant. However, his wife took it in good humor as she replied, cheating on me. During his stint on the show, fans got to see a different side to the royal as he treated his campmates and viewers by rapping songs from Vanilla Ice and Will Smith. Touching on the moment in the camp, Zara said, You went in early with that on day two, teed yourself up for it and that's your repertoire gone. When they arrive at their hotel, Mike was reunited with the celebrities who were booted off of the show before him as he remarked on how good they all smelled. Dot back in their hotel room, it wasn't long before radio legend Chris Moyles popped in to welcome his friend back to normality with a bucket of beer. Joking to Zara that he looked after him during his time on the show, he asked how it felt to finally have him back. She replied, it's just too much, let's never do this again. Mike finished the series in fourth place as he left shortly after comedian Sean Walsh. When Jill was announced as the winner, the football star was visibly shocked as she told the Geordie duo she couldn't believe it. Commenting on the win, she said, these guys, fellow campmates, were absolutely incredible. We were one big team, I don't think there should be one winner. We couldn't have got through it without all of us and I think we've all been winners of I'm a Celebrity. I'm a Celebrity, get me out of here. The coming out show tomorrow at 9. 15pm on ITV1.